everybody, it's Sarah here with Keys of the Kingdom, and today I am so excited to do this unboxing of the newest Artsa box. This is the Golan Heights Artsa box, and I will put a link down below here where you can go check out Artsa and all that they do, and look at the different details of the subscriptions. It is a Christian subscription box. And it is done by artists that are in Israel. And so if you cannot go visit Israel, this is, I would say, like having Israel sent to you. So let's not waste any time. Let's open this up and check out what's inside. Okay, it has the beautiful arts, uh, logo here on the box and this is again the Golan Heights box okay so this is box number seven golan heights and it has this beautiful picture here and then on the back it has welcome to the golan and it their their um theme here is the holy land delivered so that's arts's theme and then it says learn hebrew it has some english words hebrew words uh, how they're written and then the pronunciation of these words So that's beautiful. Okay, let's take a look here. This says, Golan Heights, what's in your box? This says, a taste of Golan. What's included in your Golan box? Mouth-wateringly delicious sumac spice blend with accompanying, accompanying recipe card, guaranteed to enhance every meal with this rich and exotic Middle Eastern spice. Golan Heights inspired herbal tea infusion sure to warm up your wintry mornings. Each tea box was made with the help of young adults with physical disabilities, which you are helping to support. Thank you. Hand poured Golan Dew scented candle. Bring the scent of the Golan Spring in its full bloom to your home. Hebrew alphabet wooden puzzle. Learn the Hebrew alphabet in this custom made wooden game for Artsa. The perfect game to display on your living room table. De Carina, excuse me, white chocolate with raw cacao nib infusions, an absolute delight. Ancient olive oil lamp and jug replicas from the time of Jesus, discovered in the cave, caves of the Golan Heights. And for our premium subscribers, we partnered with the talented artist Emmanuel to create this stunning hand-painted piece of art that reflects the lush and colorful flower bloom of spring in the Golan Heights. We hope that this magnificent piece brings color and joy into your home. And then it has more information about Artsa. Beautiful. Okay, and so then they include cards for each of the pieces that are in your box. And these are the artists that created each of the pieces. And so this shares about each artist and it's really cool. It tells you the story about each artist. And so that's a really neat thing to include here. I really like that. Okay, and these are the postcards. This is sumac roast chicken. Oh, they've created this recipe that goes along with the spice that's included here inside the box. So that looks good. Yum. Ooh, we'll have to make that. Okay, and then it, they include some beautiful postcards. This one says Gamla Fortress. Beautiful. And this one says Mount Hermon. Beautiful. Okay, now let's dive into the actual box itself. I think I want to move the box so I can have more space here to dig into the box. 
Let me grab the card, though, that says what's in the box, because then we can dive into each thing in detail here. All right. Okay, I'm going to move the box this direction. Okay, nice. Okay, so the first thing that I am bringing out of the box itself is this says Rose Barak Sumac Sourced from their ancient origins. Sumac. Natural spices. I am not familiar with sumac. So I will, uh, I will be intrigued to find out what this tastes like. I'm going to open it right now and take a smell because I'm curious. A shame you can't smell things through video. Oh, that has a very, very nice earth. I would say it's an earthy smell. That's how I would describe that. That's nice. That is probably going to be delicious. Okay. Let's see what's next here. All right. I have the box here. Let me slide this back over here for you. They packed the box very well. And so it has this packing uh, stuff here that keeps your items nicely protected as they are coming to your door, which is really important. And it's great because it's like the, the thin cardboard pieces in here, and I actually just reuse them. <laughs> for other things, so it's nice. All right, let's see what's next in here. this in. Right. Okay, so this is New Chocolate Mania. This says De Carina Chocolatiers. Three generations white chocolate squares with rock cacao nibs. That is very nice packaging. It looks and sounds wonderful and we are about to find out what it tastes like. This is the Chocolate Mania series from Decorina is a magical journey of artistic chocolate creation. It began with a family spanning three generations on three different continents that together created one world of unique quality chocolate. Our creations combine the European accuracy, South American passion, and Israeli innovation to create an exciting mix of contrasting flavors, delicacy, and softness, resulting in a flavorful chocolate experience that is truly enjoyable. Enjoy. Yum. This ingredients list says white chocolate, 93%, cocoa butter, milk, powder, sugar, soy, lectin, as emulsifier, not in Passover, natural vanilla, and cocoa nibs. Okay. Let's take a look at this. Okay. So, it comes out of the package like that, and, um, no, I don't think I want to use my cutter B scissors on that. Oh. Okay, I'm going to open it with these little scissors that I, oh, maybe not. 
probably is made to open now. It's made to open easily. I should have known. Okay, so you just pull it back here and look at that. Pretty Decorina is on the chocolate. I'm just going to take this small piece here and taste it. Mmm. That's really good. In fact, it's so good. I'm going to have the rest of the piece before I put it in a bag. <laughs> I don't want it to get everywhere, so I'm going to just put it in a Ziploc baggie here and stick it back in the box so I can share it with my family tomorrow. That's really good, guys. Oh my goodness, that is. If you like white chocolate, that's really yummy. Okay, next. Okay, so this piece. what we have. Okay. Oh. Golden Dew Scented Soy Wax Candle. 100% vegan wax, handmade, inspired by the Golan. Soul, it says, and it's four ounces, made in Israel. Burn within sight, keep away from combustibles, and keep away from children, of course. Okay, let's take a smell of this. Shame you can't smell it. Oh, that has a very beautiful light scent. Oh, that's wonderful. I like that a lot. Okay, that's a nice, nicely, this is glass with a, just a metal lid. And it's a really nice, light smelling candle. I love that. <clears throat> okay, let's check out what's next here. is the save that packaging. I like to reuse packaging so that makes it nice. Okay this says Golan Heights blend. Oh it's 20 tea bags. Lemongrass, rose, and lemon verbana. Okay so this is where is it on here? herbal tea infusion. Hmm. Let's take a look at what this looks like and smells like. Okay. Shalva tea, Israeli herbal infusions. Okay. Come on, I cut it open. Okay, there we go. Okay. So it just comes in and the bag and I am going to cut this open so I can smell it actually. Oh that smells wonderful already. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. So this is your tea bags here and they don't have the string on them like I would see most of the time here. Oh that smells incredibly good. Oh my goodness. That smells so good. This is lemongrass, rose lemon verbena profile, breezy and uplifting. Pour hot water over tea bags, steep for three to five minutes. For iced tea, first brew hot, let cool, then pour over ice. Made in Israel, kosher. Our tea bags are made from fiber and are com compostable. Please remember to recycle this carbon after carton after use oh that smells so good i want to have a cup of that tea <laughs> that would be so nice that is beautifully packaged and smells amazing i will have to try some of that out here soon and share on social media as to what i think of it but i can already tell you that's going to be wonderful okay 
And the next one. <clears throat> ah. This is the Hebrew Alphabet Wooden Puzzle. Okay. So let's pop this open. So this says, learn the Hebrew alphabet in this custom-made wooden game for Artsa. The perfect game to display on your living room table. Okay, let's take a look at this game here. Okay, so it's a box that opens. That's nice. And then it has wooden pieces in here. And it has Gaia's Tangram. This special Gaia's Tangram contains two identical sets of four wooden pieces and a deck of cards. Cards one through seven refer to a single set of pieces, four piece game. Try to assemble the silhouette on the cards using only four non-identical pieces. You can play a single player game or complete between or, or compete between two players to see which one can solve the card first. Cards 8 through 29 refer to all the pieces, eight piece game. Try to assemble the Hebrew letters, the Hebrew alphabet according to the cards using all eight pieces. This is a single player game. The forms and figures given here are just some of the many possibilities you can explore when playing Gaia's Tangram. Try to invent your own figures using four or eight pieces. If you wish to assemble the ABC or other figures, log on to Gaia's website, www.gaia-game.com, find the game catalog number 6634, and click Cards. The Art of Thinking. Let's pop this open. Maybe. I don't want to cut myself for the cards. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. Of course, I just cut my fingernails off today. That's all right. I'll just use a little more scissor help here, if possible. Thank you very much. There we go. Finally, I'm going to get into it, I promise. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, let's take a look at this. It's the instructions there, and this is number one. It's T. It looks like a T. I don't know if it's a T or if it's not a T, but it is let's see. Let's see if I can make one here. Ha ha ha. This is card number one. Okay. Look at that. I put together card number one. That's pretty cool. That's neat. I will have to get on the website and look at the rest of the information that's there. That's really cool. So you can learn the Hebrew letters here, which is really cool. If you're interested in that sort of thing, I think it's really neat. That's really, that's really fun. Okay. Plus it's really compact, which I like. We are... Okay. I think I opened it upside down. That's probably the bottom. So let's do this. Okay. This makes more sense to me.
because then that's going to be on the top. Like so. Perfect. That's beautiful, too. I really like that. That's very well made. That's nice. That'll be a fun thing to do with my girls. They'll be interested in that. I like that. <clears throat> okay, let's set that over here, and let's find out what else we have in the box. Okay, this... Okay, two more things here. This is... Maranatha. Awesome. The Wise Virgin's Parable Clay Oil and Lamp Filler Set. Jesus Period Replica Pottery. Educational and Fully Functional. Cool. Jesus' par Jesus's Parable of the Wise Virgins. Then the Kingdom of Heaven shall be likened to ten virgins who took their lamps and went out to meet the bri bridegroom. Now five of them were wise and five were foolish. Those who were foolish took their lamps and took no oil with them. But the wise took oil in their vessels with their lamps. Matthew 4, 25, 1. Be prepared. Made in Israel. Set includes replica clay oil lamp from Jesus' time, matching clay oil filler and two cotton wicks, certificate of authenticity, and biblical presentation of the parable. Well, that's cool. This is a nice little box. Scan the code for information on how to use the oil lamp. Cool. Take a peek here. Awesome. Okay. Okay, what do we have here? Okay. So, be wise and ready. Okay. I'm not going to read that entire thing to you, but it talks about uh, Jesus coming back again and what this pottery represents for us. Oh, that's kind of come apart in here. That's really cool. Two cotton wicks here. So you have the oil lamp right here. This would be where you dump the oil in. And this would be where you keep your extra oil. And then, of course, you would light your wick and have your lamp lit. Or it would come out there. Yeah. So that's really a cool little thing. It's a nice, um, it's kind of a nice conversation starter, I think. You can really, uh, Keep that in your home. It's a nice, really cool decoration. That would be a really good conversation piece to start a conversation with people that uh, that you could witness to, actually, if they're not saved. I actually like that a lot. That's really cool. So I will have to look up the information and give it a try. Fully functional, it says. So that will be neat. I bet my girls will like trying that out with me too. And finally, let's see what the last thing in the box is here. Okay, this is the premium box here. And so this is for if you get the premium subscription. This is Yair Emmanuel. And he lives and creates in Jerusalem. Emmanuel's designs of Judaic art are based upon a fusion of traditional motifs and ancient Jewish manuscripts with modern and oriental art. Vivid and harmonious colors, as well as a mixture of the old and the new, characterize Emmanuel's work, which he designs and crafts in his Jerusalem studio. Wow, so this is really cool. That's a really pretty card. I like that. It's a very nice quality also. Very vivid and beautiful colors there. Okay. Okay, so this is a hand-painted piece of art that reflects the lush and colorful flower bloom of spring in the Golan Heights. So, let's 
take a look. First, I can notice that it's metal here. And this is signed by the artist here on the back. And this is hand painted. So I'm assuming each and every are oh, wow. So each and every one of these would be uh, hand painted by Emmanuel in his Jerusalem workshop. That's beautiful. Oh, that is so pretty. I love that. Look at that. It's got beautiful birds and it looks like a beautiful, I would call it a tree. That's beautiful. It's just vibrant and what a pretty piece of art. So I'll probably keep this on my desk in my office. That's beautiful. And so that is the premium piece in this box for premium subscribers. And again, I will put the link to grab a subscription to the Arts of Box down below, or you can just go in and check it out, find out some information about the company and what they do and the artists. And also uh, down below is a discount code that you can use to receive a discount if you use my code. So I hope that you have enjoyed this unboxing of the Golan Heights box and that you go and check it out. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you can know when I release new videos. Goodbye.